So you wanna build a coffee van? First things first, you're gonna need to make coffee. And for me personally, I like to learn how to make coffee really well. Yeah, Sage Barista, Sage Barista Express is what I have been learning on. Learning on this machine is completely different to learning on a sort of professional machine, to be honest. Uh, once I started working at the cafe that I work at now, it was a whole different ball game. And every time I'm at work for a few days and I get used to their machine, I come home and I struggle to get back into the swing of things with my machine and vice versa. But when I do get the van, um, I'll just, I'll have to start learning again with my new machine. This tastes all right, I'll turn it into a flat white. Mm, yeah, that tastes nice. Fruity, I think. I really want to get better at tasting coffee, and especially this as a little long black, that would be beautiful, but um, I fancy a flat white, so that is what I'm going to make. Let's see how we go. I am using Khalifa Farms. Oat milk is the best, by the way. Soya, almond. Should be illegal in coffee. Okay, so I've got my coffee. And we're just gonna have a very quick little chat. This video is not gonna be long, I promise. Yeah, I've been a barista for the last few months. I really, really genuinely really love it. Um, <laughs> it's kind of just in me to like serve people and be sort of hospitable. Like, I've kind of always worked in those kind of jobs. I can't imagine me ever not working one of those jobs, but um, where I've come to now and what I've decided on is that obviously, you know, I wanna work for myself and I wanna be my own boss. I wanna earn my own money and um, I would really, really love to have a coffee truck or a coffee van. Two to three things that I'm probably gonna just focus on for the next like couple of weeks, um, staying accountable. The reason why I'm sort of making this video and writing this stuff down and turning this into something that I can um, watch back and keep track of is, yeah, again, just so that I actually stay on top of stuff because ever since I started my barista job at the cafe, I've let it slip a little bit. I've got very much into the cafe job and I really, really do enjoy it. Um, every time I go in, I go in there with um, a really positive mindset and I work really hard and I try really hard to get better each time that I'm there. And because that's been a really big focus for me, thinking about how I might then turn it into something that is um, my own business has slipped a little bit. So yeah, again, I just wanna keep staying on top of stuff and staying accountable and working towards it. So a couple of things that I'm gonna be thinking about for the next um, few weeks. Number one, names. So what I'm gonna call my business, what the what the coffee business will be called. And then secondly, um, I'm gonna finally write a dream budget. If there was like no limitation on money, um, what I would spend on what, and then obviously from there I can scale it back to something that's maybe a little bit more realistic. <laughs> yeah, and then thirdly, or just like around that, is gonna be just continuing on with what I've been doing a little bit already of, which is just like watching YouTube videos, listening to some podcasts, uh, looking at sort of like things online about starting a business, and then more specifically about starting a coffee van business. Gathering like other people's experiences, other people's thoughts, advice, um, legal, stuff surrounding it that kind of thing just like trying to absorb as much as i can so yeah what i'm basically saying to you today is that i want you to help me stay accountable i'm going to post some videos every few weeks or so and i'm going to put them into a playlist um and yeah i'm just going to take you on the journey of building a business starting a coffee truck uh, learning to make coffee all that kind of stuff i'm going to put into this playlist and put into these videos and maybe you've got advice for me maybe you've got other um, suggestions for things that I'm thinking about, maybe you want to learn as well, maybe just interested in seeing the journey. 
but I would really love it if you would you know, join me and watch all these videos and stay up to date with how I'm getting on. If you're interested in that, please do hit like on the video and please do subscribe to my channel so you can stay up to date, that would be amazing. And um, yeah, thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.